So I got two different questions I'm going to help real quick. These two people right here, this nice girl, and uh, I'm not sure if it's a girl too, but Aaron and Exotic Fox both asked me two different questions. First, Aaron, uh, first Exotic Fox, she says, Hey, thanks so much. It really worked. I only have one issue, though. I can't get my game to save. How can I resolve that? The other question is, this is so helpful and definitely the farthest I have gotten in downloading, but I am still getting stuck when trying to launch. The message I am getting reads, game cannot be started. I thought I had another one where somebody was saying something about uh, thousands of colors. Uh, so let's go ahead with hers. She said she can't get the game to say, so more than likely this should resolve the other one. Uh, if you If you installed it right... If you followed my my shit that I told you to do, you shouldn't have this problem. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to capability mode, capability mode, go run this program in capability. And if 3 doesn't work, if XP service pack 3, go try any of these between XP and 8. If you're running Windows 8, then it should stop at Windows 7. And another in another video, I'll probably show you how to install Windows XP on a virtual machine which is right here I'll show you how to do that another uh, another time because I have to go to work soon and I'll show you how to do that and it should run in Windows XP easily another moral question people have all the time about that is oh but isn't that stealing technically if you downloaded the Sims complete collection from my Google Drive you just stole the game but this game is no longer being sold in stores by the company at all. They made their money back in 2003, so it's fine. Same thing with Windows XP. Now, how you can get Windows XP, I'm going to leave that up to you. There's hundreds of ways to get it, and it's super duper easy. Like the Pirate Bay 1337X, uh, Demonoid, whatever you want to use. I don't give a shit. Um, try Reduce Color Mode. I'm actually going to turn that off because that actually doesn't apply to me. Um, run this program as administration mode and it should work. I actually, one more quick thing. Uh, the other thing is, this is just for demonstration purposes. Please don't do this. You will want to kill yourself. See this? That little dash W does this. It makes it into window mode. Hey, that's different. Huh. I've never seen... Oh, that's actually funny. It accidentally took that. Whatever. Can we, can we line it up? Can we line it up? Oh, that's a trippy horn slice. Okay, so I don't know why that happened, but... So I had him go do something. I was, I've recorded this like three times. So yes, if that doesn't work, then uh, delete all the files and restart from scratch. That's my only other option. Now, if you get into the load loop, like I've gotten into the load loop before, and you don't have it, if you want to make sure that it works before, if it has a load loop issue or anything like that, I highly recommend doing this, putting the W at target, and if it's having the load loop issue, right click, go to task manager, pull that shit up, and look for the Sims, right click, and just do this, literally. Where the fuck are you? In task, it's going to end it, kick it, good. Now, if you're still having that issue and you're not sure, if, you, if you're not sure whether or not it's in administration mode, you see that little shield right there. That little shield right there should tell you that it's in administration mode. But if you're still not sure, run as admin, uh, administration mode. Am I saying that right? Run as administrator. What, you know what I'm saying. And it should come up. Again, you're back on top of the world. But... Some things cannot be resolved, so if somebody wants to lend me a hand from the Sims community, if somebody wants to, you know, tell me what I'm doing wrong, by all means, I'm all ears. Uh, send me a link, send me a video, send me a comment. I will do whatever you need me to do for the Sims, because I love this game to death, and I'm willing to lend a hand anytime you ask. So let me know in the comment section below if that resolved, if it didn't. I'll keep looking for answers. Let me know.